Hi guys, my name is Radonna Warner and I am an artist with Saint Makeup. I want to show you a really simple eye. I start my eyes with my vanilla dust setting powder. I have very, very hooded eyes. Like there is a crease way back in there, but it's way back. So I'm going to start with vanilla dust everywhere. I don't start with a traditional highlight primer because I want less product on my eyes. I don't want to add anything more because the more you add, for me, the more my lids droop. So I'm starting with vanilla dust. I love what it does for the staying power. Staying power. Then I'm going to go in with my eyeshadow brush, the double ended, and I'm going to start with a fluffy end. Um, kind of swirl that around tap off the excess and I'm going to go super lightly above my crease in my brow area my brow bone area and you will see a big transformation in my eyes this will not take long I'm gonna wipe off my brush and go in with my next color. It is called Zion. The first one was Bubba. Did I tell you that? Bubba. Zion. Now with this one, again the fluffy in, I'm going to stamp the top of my brush in to my little tin. And then I'm going to stamp that into the corner of my eye. For me, this has been a game changer because that's all that I'm gonna need stamp it and tap it and then I do super light blending to kind of blend those two together and bring that color over towards the center of my eye but not across my eye and you will see why in just a minute and then I'm going to go into my lightest highlight shade for me it's palace dab my finger in and put a little bit of palace here this is to help two things it brightens my eye and it also lets me put some shimmer on my eye and it will stay right where this has been placed so you can tell a big difference already with that the shimmer that I'm going to go in with is just a simple one called Drift. I recommend it to almost everybody. It looks kind of gray um, when you look online, but look. Mm, so good. It is not gray. Tap in with my ring finger and then just gently apply. You can also put a tiny bit up here. You don't need much you just need to go to the top part of your brow a little up here and then I'm going to go in with the smaller end of my brush and put a little in the inner corner you do not need much of this but look at the difference huge this is not a super dramatic eye at all. You can do this for every day of the week. And then I'm going to go back in and do a little bit of blending. See, I don't really like how that has drugged down a little bit. So I will probably go in and correct that with my highlight. I want to keep those colors where I place them, but I'm blending just to kind of blur the lines a little bit. And then to correct anything that has come down too far. I go back into my palace, my, sh my lightest shade color, and draw a clean, a new clean line. Makes all the difference. Do not tug on your eyes. Do everything with gentle, gentle motions. And that's better. Okay, all I have to do is add a little bit. I'll put a little bit of the darker underneath my eye. The darker was called Zion. This will be my eyeliner. It really helps bring some dimension to your eyes. Add your favorite mascara and you're done.
I hope you like this one. Let me know what you think. Would you try this one?